No Regrets by Aesop Rock. Lucy was seven and wore a head of blue barrettes. City born into this world with no knowledge and no regrets had a piece of yellow chalk with which she'd draw upon the street the many faces of the various locals that she would meet. There was Joshua, age ten, bully up the block, who always took her milk money at the morning bus stop. There was Mrs. Crabtree and her poodle. She always gave a wave and a holler on her weekly trip down to the bingo parlor. As she drew men, women, kids, sunsets, clouds, and she drew skyscrapers, fruit stands, cities, towns, always said hello to passers-by. They'd asked her why she passed the time attaching lines to concrete, but she would only smile. Now all the other children living in or near her building ran around like tyrants, soaking up the open fire hydrants. They would say, Hey, little Lucy, want to come jump double dutch? Lucy would pause, look, grin, and say, I'm busy, thank you much. Well, well, one year passed, and believe it or not, she covered every last inch of the entire sidewalk, and she stopped. Lucy, after all this, you're just giving in today? She said, I'm not giving in, I'm finished and walked away. One, two, three, that's the speed of the seed. A, B, C, that's the speed of the need. You can dream a little dream, or you can live a little dream. I'd rather live it, because dreamers always chase but never get it. Lucy was 37, and introverted somewhat. Basement apartment in the same building she grew up in. She traded in her blue barrettes for long locks hut up with a clip, traded in her yellow chalk for charcoal sticks, and she drew. Little Bobby, who would come to sweep the porch, and she drew the mailman, delivered every day at four. Lucy had very little contact with the folks outside her cubicle day, but found it suitable, and she liked it that way. She had a man now, Rico, similar, hermit. They would only see each other once or twice a week on purpose. They appreciated space, and Rico was an artist too, so they'd connect on Saturdays to share the pictures that they drew. Look! Now every month or so, she'd get a knock upon the front door, just one of the neighbors acting nice, although she was a strange girl, really, say, Lucy, want to join me for some lunch? Lucy would smile and say, I'm busy, thank you much. And they would make a weird face the second the door shut and run to tell their friends how truly crazy Lucy was. And Lucy knew what people thought, but didn't care, because while they spread the rumors through the street, she'd paint another masterpiece. One, two, three, that's the speed of the seed. A, B, C, that's the speed of the need. You can dream a little dream, or you can live a little dream. I'd rather live it, because dreamers always chase, but never get it. Lucy was 87 upon her deathbed at the senior home where she had previously checked in, traded the locks and clip for a headrest, traded in the charcoal sticks for arthritis. It had to happen, and she drew no more, just sat and watched the dawn had a television in the room that she'd never turned on. Lucy pinned up a life's worth of pictures on the wall and sat and smiled and looked each one over just to laugh at it all. Now, Rico, he had passed about five years back, so the visiting hours pulled in a big flock of nothing. She'd never spoken much throughout the spanning of her life until the day she leaned forward, grinned, and pulled the nurse aside, and she said, Look, I've never had a dream in my life, because a dream is what you want to do, but still haven't pursued. I knew what I wanted and did it till it was done. So I've been the dream that I wanted to be since day one. Well, the nurse jumped back. She'd never heard Lucy even talk, especially words like that. She walked over to the door and pulled it closed behind. Then Lucy blew a kiss to each one of her pictures, and she died. One, two, three, that's the speed of the seed. A, B, C, that's the speed of the need. You can dream a little dream or you can live a little dream. I'd rather live it. Because dreamers always chase, but never get it.